PS5 game came out in February. Werewolf the Apocalypse. Bruh. I've seen this game. It's on sale and uh you can tell it's a werewolf. So don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. I really appreciate it. Let's get into the video. I'm so excited. I guess not man until you can barely see the darkest symbol. Basically, you can turn yourself into a wolf. I've seen this gameplay. This game is sick. So don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe if y'all want to see more of this. Why everything black and white? A leaf? Basically, this like set in apocalyptic times. Oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Let's get it. There with the pet. Come to me. Did they come to me? What is that? What the heck? Yo. Let's go, man. What is that? Yo, what the heck? Let's go. Is that me? Oh. I can already tell this game will be sick. Yo! Bonuses. I don't want to see this again. Oh, I gotta change my wolf? Let's go, baby! Do I want a spirit companion? Yeah. Dear Cliff. What cool I want in original Moonlight Fall Spirit Sandstorm. Moonlight. I don't want no spirit companion. We gonna go, uh, we gonna go on easy so we can focus on the story. Yo, this game is sick. The pack track meal is driving. 
corporation out of their territory after several weeks preparation they finally have a plan Ooh. the wild mm -hmm. what about it the weaver uh-huh okay and the worm three okay. primal forces from which the world Gaia springs okay the wild is creation formless and abundant. Yo, this show look the weaver shapes, making order out of chaos. Yo. The worm, whose purpose was to destroy the old, to make room for the new, went mad. Now, a force of corruption. Feeding on greed, malice, and hate. Yeah, it ravages Gaia. So what, I'm, so what did that Through its mean? unwitting accomplices, mankind. The balance between those three forces is long gone now. Insidiously, the worm gains more and more ground every day. Vitalized by the damage humans have brought to the earth. We, the werewolves, remain born of man, beast, and spirit. We are the vindication of Gaia and the wild. The best way to get Indran out of the region is to attack their bottom line. We have a plan to convince them there's no profit to be had here. Ludmilla, if you please. I've recently gained access to the system that controls all the on-site oil pumps. That's our target. We tamper with the pumps and send dummy data to the system to make them think their oil field has run dry. Will that really be enough? According to the internal files I got my hands on, they treat unprofitable sites like gangrenous limbs. They'll give this one the chop right away. Uh... Seems kinda easy, don't it? I don't know. Even if we do manage to push them out, they'll only set up somewhere else. We need to hurt them, bring them down, not chase them away. We've already talked about this, Kahal. They're too close to the cairn. If we stage an attack, they'll look for the ones who did it. I don't want Indran's eyes on our home. Our best option is to work in the shadows. But if something goes wrong, my wife ends up on her own in enemy territory. I don't like it. I'm going to be fine, Call. We've been preparing this for weeks. We've calculated the risks. And if there's any sign of trouble, you and I go in and retrieve her. But I'd rather we stay covert. Ludmilla will have the easiest time on her own. I'm heading out. I want to be done before daybreak. Take care of Adana while I'm away. I think she's going a little crazy all cooped up in here. Okay. So... She Don't worry, I'll talk to her. You just focus on your mission. Call. I've got this. I love you. See you soon. All right, so this is interesting. Move around. Okay. I don't like thinking that Ludmilla's on her own, Rodko. I understand. She's my sister, remember? Oh, he should have sent Riff. And she's Adana's mother. I should be out there with her. I gave it a lot of thought. Her chances of success are better if she's alone. It's as simple as that. If things don't go as planned, you can tear through as much Endron scum as you like to get her out. But for now, we stay put. Go. Rest while we wait. 
How am I supposed to rest when I'm supposed to be saving people's lives? What's this? Not looking forward to packing all this up tomorrow morning. Whoa, whoa. What do you think, old friend? <laughs> yeah, that makes two of us. I'm not too keen on this plan. Ava did an impressive job installing all this. I'll have to thank her for this later. Got everything squared away? Not a lot to square away. All I'm doing is pressing a button once Ludmilla gets me hooked up. Still got a ways to go before I can do much more than that. If I tried to breach their network, they'd be on us in a second. Says the woman who got her hands on their files. We'd never have been able to take the fight to Endrin like this without you. Besides, you installed all of this on your own. Have faith in your abilities. That's sweet, Cahal, but I just wish I could do more. But how are you doing? Talk to your daughter yet? No, not yet. I'm just heading her way. Wait. So change. I can change sides. Oh, nice. Hey, how you doing? I'm bored out of my mind. There's nothing to do here, and it's wet and miserable. Don't worry, our work here's nearly finished. You'll be back at the cairn with your friends before you know it. I know, but why'd you have to drag me out here in the first place? It's not like you've got me doing anything out here. Your mom wanted you to come along, so you could see what our field missions entail. They entail a bunch of bullshit. All we ever do is watch and take notes. We're not accomplishing anything. Language, young lady. Right. And preparation is key. Know how your enemy will respond before you move. A foe stripped of surprise is fangless. Why didn't you go with mom anyway? She's all alone out there. If something happens to her... I wish I could have. But Rodko wants us to keep a low profile. And there's no one better at that than your mom. <laughs> Rodko's a dumbass. Hey, that's your uncle you're talking about. And the leader of our pack. You know it's his job to make those decisions. And like I said, all that observation we were doing was minimizing the danger. Your mother will be just fine, Avi. Don't worry. Oh, shit. Kahal, wake up! Gonna need you. A helicopter just touched down on the site's landing pad. Apparently, it's some Endron exec. Their presence has shaken things up. Tell me Ludmilla's okay. She's okay. They've still got no idea she's on site. But their guard patrols have changed, and certain areas are locked down. And that includes the one Ludmilla's in. So what's the plan now? The mission's sunk. We go in there, get her out, and wait for things to quiet down. But to get her off site, the locked off areas need to be manually unlocked. And Ludmilla's stuck on the wrong side. Shit. Fortunately, she has already secured a terminal. She'll guide you to her location over the radio. Go now. Bring her back. There's no time to waste. My sister needs you. All right, Ludmilla, I'm on, my way. I'm on my way. Remember, stay out of sight. I'll open any door I have access to. Also, I run with this perfect. I've opened all the external ducts. The lupus. Press O to shift to challenge this lupus form to size and speed of lupus. I'm to sneak in many parts without being noticed. The lupus can't use the algae. The vaccine will cause humans to react. Dope. I'm locked in the turbine room in the center of the site. Yeah, you this game is clean. I'm glad I bought this. The area you're passing through should be deserted right now, though. Door's locked. Ava? There's gotta be a terminal close by. Find it. Oh, and uh, deactivate any cameras you see while you're at it. 
no provision. Press R1, I mean L1, to toggle vision. Allows you to pretend into spirit world, letting them sense such as threat spirits and other connections. Oh! Yo, what? Yo, what? How do I disable the camera? Oh. I forgot, I gotta do this. This game is clean. Guards. Look, Mello, we got a lot of company. The arrival of the Endron exec has changed their setup. Tell me where you are. I'm looking at the southern part of the outer fence. And a shit ton of guards. There's no way I'll be able to make a move without being seen. Southern part of the outer fence. Got it. There. That should distract them for a few minutes. But if a guard does see you... He won't live long enough to raise the alarm. They sold their souls to Endron. They don't get anywhere, see? Hell of a time for a malfunction. I'll go check it out. And it begins. How do I get out of here? Oh. How do I get over there? I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. Oh, that's what I'm supposed to do. They take them as a way of dealing with other guards. This will increase my range, my range, my danger because I'm back. Any idea what could have caused it? I don't care. Just want it fixed and fast. Some big shot just arrived on site. <laughs> Folks upstairs want everything to be perfect. You know what? I wonder if I can take him down. And I ain't even gonna risk it. In the refinery. Perfect. I'm not far now. Nearly at the passageway leading into it. Shit! Something's following. 
following me. What is it? I think it's a black spiral dancer. Keith! But Miller, just hold on. Fuck. Rodko. I heard. No more sneaking around. We fight. Now go. I'll meet you with repeat. Let's get it. Done fucking around. Stances. I just as my speed impressed, which is very heavy stance off of the zip. So this makes me big and then this makes me like agile. Silver is crawling to me. Silver damage will lower the maximum health for the rest of the fight. <laughs> that was decent. Oh my god, what is that? Okay. Good Miller. 
call. Tell Adi. No, please, no. Listen to me! Oh, damn it! No. You need to fight the rage. Oh, this Rafid! Stop it! No! What have I done? Rafik? There's no time to mourn. We need to go. Kinda sick. Washington State, five years later. Just reported back to base. Not that there's anything to report. No kidding. Though I guess we've got a special guest coming tonight. Yeah, an engine rep, no less. She should be here soon. You know they're hiring, right? Think you'd ever make the move to Andron? Hey! What the- Clear dusk. We're good to go. Five years ago, I abandoned the woods of Tarker's Mill. I abandoned my cairn. Endrin killed my wife. I gave in to rage. The worm touched my soul. I had to leave my daughter. It was the hardest decision I ever made. And 
in other news, Andrin is joining the fight against global warming. The energy company today announced that their new biofuel will be hitting the market soon. This revolutionary new formula will be unveiled alongside the opening of their new headquarters in... This exile was my only choice. I'd become a danger to my pack. I often wonder what's become of them. Of Rodko, of Ava. All of, of them. This is the closest I've been to Tucker's Mill in five years. Five years? How much time do we have before they notice the guards on the outside have gone quiet? They report in by radio every hour. That's our deadline for getting our hands on the explosives and getting out of here. What do your clients intend to do with them anyway? <sighs> the weather stormers? They're planning on blowing up a big Magadon pharmaceutical plant. Good fucking riddance. I know Magadon's methods. They're the scum of the earth. And guess what? These explosives were originally headed to Endrin, another megacorp of assholes. Stealing from them is just icing on the cake. Let's go through the plan again, just to make sure everything's clear. You've got to swap the delivery label on the crate of explosives intended for Endrin. You do that, and they'll load us up with smiles on their faces. All you've got to do is open the gate to their delivery bay for me. I'll create a diversion while you're exchanging the labels. Got it. We'll have to play it tight, though. One hiccup and the plan falls through. We'll have you sneak around back by their storage facility. Security should be pretty thin there, especially if you go through the ventilation docks. All right. I'm off. Hey, before you go, are you sure you're up for this, man? You seem kind of stressed out back in the truck. I'm fine. Come on, we've got a job to do. Right. You if understand. you need me, I'm just to chirp away. Good luck, brother. I'm inside. Good. Try to keep a low profile, would you? Endrin reached out to me, you know. Their hiring and the pay's pretty good. I'm sure it is. They're going toe-to-toe -to -toe with a group of activists right now. Lambda Mankind. 
If I were you, I'd stay here. Keep your head down. about their new biofuel. They say they're going green by the end of the year. The only thing green about that fuel is the label. It's the same shit with new branding. A marketing stunt. They're not running the most attractive operation here. I mean, they're pumping out weapons for Endron, not selling timeshares. Looks probably aren't their priority. I made it to the delivery bay. Good. See that command post next to the gate? You should be able to open things up for me from there. Made it. Dusk, you're up. On. Once I've got their attention, you go find what we came for and slap on this fancy new delivery label. Got it? He's here for a pickup, man. Pickup? What are you talking about? There's no pickup on the schedule. Well, check it again. I, I gotta be on there. You really think I'd drive all the way out to the ass end of nowhere if I didn't have a pickup? All right, all right. But I'm gonna have to search that truck. Then let's give out that pickup. According to the intel we received, the crates of explosives should be stored around here. Creeping. 
All right, Dusk. The delivery label's been switched. Then it's time for us to get the hell out of Dodge. Wait. I smell something. Give me a minute to check it out. All right. Air problem division. Air problem division. Can we use digital text with threats? That's silver. Keep silver around to one side for the moment. The client hasn't paid. Boss yet. Order on order. Nothing to deliver until the invoice is paid. I knew I smelled it. Silver. Whoever ordered this intends to kill Garu. Dusk. They're shipping out silver bullets. You know what that means. Change of plans? Change of plans. I need to find out who's buying these bullets and why. Buy me some more time. meeting with upstairs she's from andrin here for the special order the silver bullets who even uses that shit some golden guns while she's at it you know what they say the client is king especially when the client's name is andrin Shouldn't be much longer. We were supposed to have the ammunition one week ago. One week. Endrin doesn't like waiting. Or paying, clearly. You're not getting anything until Endrin is paid up. You can tell that to your President Watkins in person. I don't think you understand what's at stake here. <laughs> Oh, I understand oh, that you've like just that. been attacked, and you're looking to hit back. I also understand that you need our ammunition to do that. And we've got that ammunition right downstairs, ready and waiting to go as soon as you've paid us. Sorry, Major. The business is business. Well, fuck you two. Then we'll attack Tarker's Mill without your help, and rest assured, Mr. Watkins will hear about this. Tarker's Mill. Hey! You and I need to talk. Who are you? Now, die! <laughs> Bollocks! Security! Alert! <laughs> Use bolts to destroy security cameras. Reinforcement into his turret. Take down that Chris range against more.
general. Dusk. What the fuck are you doing, Carl? I just had to pop a couple guards who wanted to put a bullet in my head. Get the fuck back here already. Sorry, but I didn't have a choice. Keep the engine running. We're out of here as soon as I get back. in the boss's office, but I'm not getting any response from that sector. Take your positions, people. Maximum alert until the situation's clear. Oh! 
Something's up over there. Show yourself. Stay alert. Don't let him get back. Toppers Mill. There's a mill with toppers on it. This game is legit, though. We're too late. Engine is already here. What do we do? Stop the truck. What's even down there? My home. Dusk, stay out of this. Wait! Call! Rodko! Rodko, they've cleared our northern line. They have an exo. We'll take care of the wounded later. We have to stop them. Let's go! Move! <laughs> Thank you. 
Tell me, where's Adana? Don't worry, Cahal. Your daughter didn't fight this battle. How are your wounds? Riddled with silver. I'll take days to heal. But things would have been far worse if you hadn't stepped in. I just did what I had to do. Nothing more. I honestly never thought I'd see your face again. Why'd you come back, Cahal? I heard that the Cairn was going to be attacked. I was afraid for you. For Adana. And how did you hear that? I overheard Endrin talking about it on my last job. I may have left Tarker's mill, but I never turned my back on it. I couldn't just abandon you. You found it easy enough five years ago. Your Cairn and your daughter have always needed you. I tried to tell you that. Where is she, Rodgo? With Ava. Working undercover at the biggest Indran site in the Pacific Northwest. The best option available to us after the failure of our last mission. Rodko, you let Adana infiltrate Indran? My fucking daughter? After what happened with her mother? Your daughter is the best undercover agent I have. We will not win our fight for Gaia without first bringing Indran down. And with your daughter on the inside, we're closer than ever. She may not fight like we do, but she's every bit as strong. You should respect that. The work she's doing inside Indran is absolutely vital. More so after what their private fucking army just did to us. I'm afraid her work won't be able to stop Indran from retaliating against us. Not after our last mission. Your last mission? What do you mean? You remember the old abandoned mine not far from here? Indran bought it and turned it into a training center for their new recruits. I launched an attack to wipe them out, but Tank Girl stopped us. The woman you saw in the exo during the attack, she drove us back. Tank Girl, you call her. I encountered her during my last mission. She was trying to buy silver bullets from an arms dealer. That's where I learned she was planning an attack on the Cairn. Major Grainer. That's the name her men give her. But to us, she's Tank Girl. And she leads Endron's troops with about as much grace. Their attack on the Cairn was their first wave of revenge for our attack on the training center. We managed to repel them this time. But it's only a temporary victory. They might return at any moment. And Endron just keeps recruiting soldiers. Then we've got to go back to the mine and destroy their training center. It's the only way to buy the Cairn any sort of safety. No matter how brief. Go back? No. Not until I'm well again. Then we can strike. I'll take care of that goddamn training center myself. You know I can handle it on my own. No. You're no longer a part of this pack. It's my responsibility. And how long will it take for you to get better? Days? Weeks? If they return, the cairn will fall. Huh. I'll think about it. Go pay your respects to your Fen and come back to me. Then we'll talk about the mine. The cairn is an 
a bad way. It has been many a year since I last felt your presence, warrior of Gaia. It's been nearly as long since anyone called me that. Your cairn needs you, and the wild has need of your protection. The Eater of Souls is fighting with all his might to take control of it. And he is winning. The corruption takes many forms, but the effects are always the same. You must help us fight back. I'm not worthy to be your protector, Yifen. I've given into my rage. To the worm. I'm nothing but a danger to the spirits of Gaia. So you claim. But even now, you prepare to destroy the worm's forces slithering beneath the Earth's surface. You may think that you are fighting for your own interests, but it is still Gaia you serve. To fight your battles, you will need power. Power I can provide by helping you develop your warrior gifts. Thank you, Ifen. You may find lost spirits during your travels. Return them to me, and I will be able to strengthen your natural abilities. One last request before you depart. Many of your kin fell in combat. I would ask you to bury them. You will find their bodies both inside and around the cairn. Your penumbra vision will show you the way. Soothe their souls and- I will if I can, but my priority is Endrin's training center. Weaken the forces of the worm there, but Nagaya. Ghost changed his mind. Ceres? But how? She was in the back, tending to the wounded. It's all my fault. They Agnes didn't even house. know how to fight. He was a spirit healer, a caretaker of children. Endrin doesn't show anyone mercy. And we won't either. Keep an eye out. We may have pushed them back, but who knows what they're capable of. Rodko's counting on us. Dusk, what are you doing here? 
I thought I told you to keep clear. You really thought I'd leave you behind like that? You should know me better than that by now. Besides, looks like you need all the help you can get. I really don't want to lose my front row tickets to the Cajal show. Thanks, Dusk. Okay, yeah, no. Thanks sounds real weird coming out of you. Put that shit away. Well, if you really want to help. I'll go look after the injured. I rang the weather stormers and asked them to let... Don't worry about me. You just do what you gotta do. Hey, Cajal. It's good to see your face again. I went to see Fen. He's gotten so weak. Please, Rotko, let me help you. Let me deal with this training center. Why is it that you care now, Cajal? We were so easy to ignore when we went right in front of you. What? You want to be part of the pack again? I want to help the pack. I want to protect Adana. But you don't intend to rejoin us. I've already given in to rage and killed one of our kin, Rotko. I can't take the risk of doing it again. You already know I disagree. Nonetheless, we are united by those we mourn. So I'll accept your help. So what can you tell me about this so-called training center? Ava managed to get a hold of the mine blueprints to help us prepare for our previous attack. The site's weak point is its power supply. They apparently haven't had the time to give it a proper upgrade. The whole thing is powered by one big propane tank, just like it was when it was a mine. I see. So if I blow up the tank, the whole mine... Then we'll need explosives. You'll be happy to know I didn't come back empty-handed. I'm aware. I met your new friend... Dusk, right? You've still got a problem, though. You don't know the layout of the site, and I'm too injured to go with you. Huh. I don't like touching the stuff. But I suppose I'll use Ava's radio equipment to guide you. Perfect. So we'll stay in radio contact. Take the explosives and go. Good luck, Kahal. Now, we're Dusk, talking. my friend, I owe you. Perhaps I need to enlist. So the fine is always less than the cost of compliance. <laughs> Bingo. You here to enlist? Absolutely. That's the spirit. Did you register on our website? Nah, I prefer to do things in person. Can't say I blame you. What's your name? Kahal Fillin. Kahal Fillin. Hell of a name. There you go. You're on the list. All right, then. Go report to the instructor for testing. He's in the warehouse. Oh, and one last thing. Looking at you, it's pretty obvious you've done some time. Try not to mention that. The instructor hates ex-cons. This way. Control, I've got a candidate for you. Welcome. If you're looking to sign up, you have to talk to the instructor. Head over to that building in the courtyard. Uh, 
I'm here to be recruited. You? How'd you make it through the physical without breaking a hip? <sighs> All right, Gramps. Let me just find you on the list here. The name's Mitchell. No Mitchell on my list. I'm warning you now. We don't take kindly to recruits who fuck around. So, what's your story? I'm a merc. Protection, assault, extraction. I've done it all. That's what I like to hear. You're just the sort we're looking for. Now let's get down to business. You ready for the interview? I'm ready. Let's start with a technical question then. Our assault troops are equipped with a new type of pump-action rifle. What kind of sight is it equipped with? Pump actions don't have sights. Wrong. They have a holographic sight. But I understand why you'd get that wrong, Grandpa. Back in your day, they probably still had bayonets. Let's talk engine now. The company has an internal motto for those in the know. Can you tell me what it is? Hmm. Greener today for a brighter tomorrow. Look around, you dumbass. Do you think Endrin gives a shit about going green? That's just the swill we serve the masses. Okay, enough of this paper pushing bullshit. I know a combat vet when I see one. Welcome to Endrin's training program. Head over to the waiting room. Someone will come get you new recruits in a few minutes. Understood. Test just like that. Well done. But they want to make you wait. We don't have time for that. You should see a command post overlooking the waiting room. You'll have a computer inside and a service door leading into the mine. That computer will allow you to open the service door and cut communications with the lower floor. And the people here won't know what's going on in the training center. Skill point.
first person. This game is low key kind of kind of kind of dope. state-of-the-art training regimen disappointment into a hardened killer. Once your training is over, you'll be outfitted with the best equipment the money can buy. Before you begin, you'll be given a checkup by our medical staff. During this comprehensive checkup... The hell the Sound the alarm! <laughs>
I see the tank. You're going to have to cut through the medical sector to get there. They're injecting something into their recruits. batch of recruits is trained. Two months for most of them. Less for the ones who react well to the serum. Excellent. I'll communicate that to Major Cruz. Sound the alarm! What the? Area! Come on! Ah! 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 Bend down! Set back up! We need it! today so don't forget to hit the like button subscribe i really appreciate it until next time later